Bene, buonasera e benvenuti a questa conferenza. Uh, cosa possiamo dire? Oggi è un giorno molto importante. Uh, uh, I'm sorry, they told me that I can start also to speak in English because we have the translator. So, uh, welcome to everybody. We are in Rome. Um, uh, I guess in some uh, couple hours it will start the, the stations of the cross. And that's why we are live on the radio with uh, some guests to talk about this great uh, event that uh, is happening now in this moment and in a couple of hours in Rome. We have uh, uh, with us uh, one of the most uh, uh, historic of the stations of the cross, it's uh, Father Umberto. Uh, and then we will have uh, some other guests, maybe we will have uh, Professor uh, uh, Pedro de Contenido, I'm sorry, from uh, Barcelona. And then we will have also uh, Professor Van uh, Grune from München. Uh, but uh, I would like to start with uh, Professor um uh, and padre uh, especially father umberto talking about uh, uh, the stations of the cross please father thank you very much uh, welcome to everybody uh, this is a very important day facciamoci prima cross let's do first the cross padre nostro padre figlio e spirito santo uh, ringraziamo tutti quanti della radio perché i had uh, a lot of uh, uh, email uh, put it on Twitter, uh, me put it, you can uh, communicate it with me. Bene, Professor, please, uh, you can start the theme of uh, the object of the discussion. Oh, it's not only discussion, but it's uh, the conversation. Well, uh, first of all, the good evening to everybody, the station of the cross eh, refers to a series of artistic representations often sculptural, depicting Christ carrying the cross to its crucifixion. Most Roman Catholic Church contains stations of the cross. Typically placed at intervals along the side walls of the nave. In most churches they are small plaques with reliefs of painting. The tradition of moving around the station to commemorate the passion of Christ Began with San Francesco Rassis, who said, Scusa, a short wound is not due, he went away. He said, Yeah, pan, he lashed a I live here, the clothes. The clothes. He said, uh, Jesus, he said, Ah, can you hear me? He said, It's a piece of fish, they are paying you on the cross. He said, Jesus, my one one. And extended through the Roman Catholic Church in medieval period. It also observed the Lutheranism and Anglo Catholicism, it most commonly done during Lent. As it met the Lent for the major, especially on a good Friday, on Natch. Bene, uh, Padre, please, the history. Eh, no moment, I, uh, I uh, take time. Uh, the station of the cross originated in pilgrimage to Jerusalem, where is the great singer Noah. I am a viaggio, sai. Eh, professor, però, please, stay on the object, on the subject. Eh, ma the music is important. Well, professor, padre, a desire to reproduce. The only places in other lands seems to have manifested itself at quite an early date. At the monastery of Santa Stefano at Bologna, a group of connected chapels was constructed as early as the 5th century by San Petronius. Petronius. Perché I have mangiato uh, pesante. Ma tu, uh, you don't have to make uh, digiuno. Tu, tu non devi mangiare. Quelli joy this much fish. Hey, io veramente ho mangiato un poco pesante ho preso anche una fella di carne fiorentina. Uh, professor, but it's not allowed to eat uh, carne. Start sit, shut up, let me do the conference. Well, Padre, please. This may perhaps be regarded as the germ from which the station afterwards developed. To his tolerable research that nothing that we have before about the 15th century can strictly be called the way of the cross in the modern sense a prima destra vai sempre dritta come trovo Colossesi, viro o Papa. If you see the Pope with the cross, then you have the, uh, the station. Eh, 
professor, but it's not so easy because it's close to the traffic. I pick your motorino scooter. Then you take the scooter. O viaggio. Eh. Our full several travelers who visited the Holy Land during the 12th, 13th and 15th century. Ad esempio Riccardo da Monte di Croce, Burchard of Mont Sion, James of Verona, suonava pure un sassofono, però era un po' costunato. Mention a Via Sacra, set the road along with the pilgrims were conducted, there is nothing there accounts to identify this with the way of the cross as we understand it. Well, The devotion of the Via Dolorosa, perché facevano male scarpe, ci era messo il tacco 15, non poteva fare. Eh, professor, but it seems a little bit stupid that you had to do something like this uh, with a eh, quel... Quella era la moglie di James che si metteva là il tacco. For which there have been a number of variant routes in Jerusalem was probably developed by the Franciscan, after they were granted administration of the Christian only places in Jerusalem in 1342. Today, nine of the stations of the cross that were established by the Franciscan are located along the Via Dolorosa. Hey, when the pass was so why? You have troubles, as it went it away from the northwest corner of the Temple Mount to the Church of the Holy Sepulchre within which the remaining five stations are located. Well, Professor, go on. The earliest use of the word station are che a stazione centrale dove prenderò la freccia rossa o la freccia bianca. Allora, it's very simple. If you have the freccia, a freccia rossa, the red freccia, you go down, you go in the south. No. If you go to the freccia bianca, you go up. Uh, professor, but the station it's not mean like that. As applied to accustomed halting places in the Via Sacra to Jerusalem. Eh, hey, un moment, I spit. Of course, in the narrative of an English pilgrim, William Way. He said, Taro Achai, Econosachi, where is my way? I said, my way, uh, professor, but way, it's uh, a second name. Hey, way on way, he said, it's William Way. Professor, please, who visited the Holy Land in the mid-15th century and described the pilgrims following the footsteps of the Christ to the cross? Hey. In the 1521, ma they cannot, because the government has accorso to remove all the shoes consumed, consumed, of all the shoes used. And in 1521, a book called the Geistic Strass che teneva un cappotto con i brillantini a coppia, was printed, che era Swarovski, was printed with illustration of the station in the Holy Land. Well, professor, please, without publicity, please! Eh, eh, chi l'è? Il mare di Riecero, la giungondrata a basso, barra al via Roma. During the 50th and the 60th century, the Franciscan began to build a series of outdoor shrines in Europe, che lo stanno senza sordi, perché a Via Toledo stanno chiudendo tutti i negozi, they are closed all the shop. Mannacci, Mulinaro, tutto, quello mia moglie dice, eh, pa padre Umberto, lei è un padre, no, diciamo mia moglie, un'amica. Eh, quella... In Europe to duplicate the counterparts in the Holy Land. The number of stations varied between 7 and 30. 7 was common. These were usually placed off in small buildings along the approach to a church, as in the set of 1490, by Adam Graff. Allora, tu lo potevi prendere, o con Please, uh, Professor, can you explain this in English? You have a Graff, no, Graff, Adam Graff, il venivi... On the corner, you can take, you have two choices before to take the, the spirit hill away. You can take one bombolone with the crema, o con la ciliegia sopra, o, o con la graffa solo senza crema. Io yeah, abitualmente I take without the crema. Eh, hey, professore, perché me, perché state un po' ingrassando ultimamente. Eh, hey. nel cimoniano su the leading to Giovanni Girch in Nuremberg. Eh. Hey. I want you to graph prima arrivare. Before to arrive in Nuremberg, you have to eat a lot of a graph. Professor, by Adam Kraft, it's not what you say, meaning. Hey, 
A number of rural examples were established as attractions in their own right, usually on attractive wooded hills. Oi, some tevni duck. Professor, hills, no hill. Hills, eh, and no sign of me, you don't know even how se chiama duck and come se chiama a colli. Eh, vabbè, poi se, eh, abbiamo capito. This includes the sacro mondo di Domodossola. Oi, come si dice? Dico, when you make a spelling, you say, Dico come Domodos, and Sacro Monte di Belmonte 1712, e forma parte of the Sacro Monte of Piedimonte che ci va per, per la reggia di Caserta, la, la seduta di Caccia. Eh, professore, but it's not a way, it's not Piedimonte Matese. Eh, eh, professore, I start to talk like, like you. Eh, and this is good if you start to talk like, like me, because maybe you become more intelligent. Please, professor. And form, and form a part of the Sacri Mondo of Piedimonte and Lombardy, where our heritage side together with other assemble on different devotional themes. In these two sculptures, I have often approached in life sites and very elaborate. In 1686, in answer to their petition, Pope Innocent XI granted to the Franciscan the right to erect a session within their churches. In 1731, Pope Clement XII extended well the church the right to have the station, provided that the Franciscan father erected them with the consent of the local bishop. Eh, I hope that he was not too much erected, because in Europe there was a problem, killer Catholic. At the same time, the number was fixed at 14. In 1857, the bishop of England, he was a very intelligent guy, were allowed to erect all over his soil, the station of find themselves without the intervention of a Franciscan priest and in 1862 that this right was extended to bishop through the church. Well, Professor, thank you. We take a little break and then we go on on the spiritual significance. Thank you very much. Thank you to everybody.